Hey there everyone, it's Will with ManufacturedHomes.com. Welcome back to Where's Will's Manufactured Home Tours and thank you for spending some time with me today here on the channel. Today I'm out in Puyallup, Washington visiting Detray's Custom Housing and what I found for us today is a cute, quaint and cozy single wide built by kit custom home builders. So let's get in here, I'm going to tell you all about this awesome home. Today, everyone, we are taking a tour of a popular floor plan up here in the Pacific Northwest. This is the Cedar Canyon LS2071, built by Kit Custom Home Builders. This floor plan actually has a few options where you can have loft storage, more space, and even a half bath. But this one is a two-bed, one bath that sits at 660 square feet. As you see, we have a nice 8-foot by 14-foot porch. The dimensions of this home is 14 feet 9 inches by 52 feet 9 inches, and the base price for this model, $75,000. Let's go take a home tour. Where's Will? All right, so moving right along, taking a look at the inside of this home, what I'm seeing are seven and a half foot side walls, can lighting everywhere, and some awesome transom windows, letting some extra natural light in above the other windows. The size of this living room and kitchen area is 18 feet, four inches by 14 feet, nine inches. So if you cut that in half, your living room is just about nine and a half feet by 14 feet. And hey, before we get going, do me a favor, leave us a like, it helps out the channel and helps this video get to more people. And if if you've considered it, hit that subscribe button and that notification bell. That way, you'll be alerted to when a new home tour is posted. You'll be able to see these as soon as I capture them. Uh, walking into the kitchen, that little table right there is actually kind of smart. That is a round table with pull-out chairs. You know, any kind of uh, space-saving features you can find in a, in a uh, single-wide manufactured home is great because, of course, in a single-wide like this, you don't have a true um, dining area, so that's smart. But this home does have an eating counter. As you see, we have space right there, one and one on the other side. Um, and they've done some pretty good um, stuff to this home regarding space you know we have a, a cupboard over here down here i'm uh, loving the backsplash that gray that blue and that top that's nice and like i was saying we have a uh, lazy susan on this side with two shelves that's pretty cool over here taking a look we have a big dual sink with a nice window above letting that natural light in it does open and then right over here some more storage um, opportunities right there your shelf doesn't adjust that one does um, as you see we have the white appliance package set up for electrical but you could change that in the ordering process and then right over here we have another um, lazy susan for um, some more storage so you know they're they're trying to fit as much space into a home of this size as they can remember this is only 660 square feet i think it's pretty doing pretty good so far we have a drawer bank right there of about four drawers i think that's pretty much the only uh spot in the kitchen area that does have drawers so there's that and we have some storage up above and of course as you know these appliances do come with the home i'm loving the tile look on the floor nice i mean the whole aesthetic here it may be small, but it's really nice, really cute and quaint. I like that. And now, you know what, let's make our way towards the uh, guest area, check it out here. One thing I do like is there's a lot of light in the hallway here. You always need a window in the hallway in a single wide, and they have a few here, which is pretty cool. We're gonna take a look at the uh, first, the guest bath here. And again, trying to smash up as much space as they can. They have some linen storage right there. We have a drawer bank right next to that with your single uh, vanity here. And your uh, standard, this is about a 42 inch shower, I believe. Um, wrap around tile, no worry about mold or anything. It's all inclusive. The drop down there is about a four inch step and a nice transom window up top. Um, in this home, we have a uh, elongated toilet. That's really nice. And then again, space saving features right over here. What they have is a spot for your stackable washer and dryer. So everything is right here. Pretty smart in my opinion. Again, it's set up for electrical, but in that ordering process, if you need gas, you can change that. So that's pretty cool. And then again, some more storage here and you know like i said there's some options with this home there is you know an optional optional loft and other things if you want to know more about that there's a link in the description below click on that it'll take you directly to this floor plan where you can see some more photos videos 3d tours and 
get that pricing directly from a retailer near you. Um, and right here, as you see, that is your HVAC unit right in the middle of the home. And now we're gonna walk in and check out the uh, first guest room. Now the guest room here is actually for the size of this home, pretty spacious at 11 feet, five inches by nine feet, one inches one inch excuse me that's actually not too bad um, and then right over here you have a nice small closet that they've used for some storage and then right there behind that stuff that is where your water access is so in this home that's where it's located um, I'm not sure if you noticed or not but of course I did all your registers are on the floor so you're heating and air coming from below so and then moving right along we're gonna take a look at the primary here um, which is again, a decent size for a home of this size. Now, the size of this one is nine feet, five inches by 14 feet, nine inches. Pretty decent. We have a queen size bed sitting in this room. So it gives you a decent idea of how much space that will take. You still have room for like dressers and drawers and, and things like that. So it's not too tight. It's not too tight at all. I like the tiling in here. It's not like the linoleum. These are tiles. It's really good looking. And then in here we have wooden uh, coat rod, wooden shelves with the reinforced shelving. That's really nice. That's, that's an added bonus. Rounded corners through this home, everything. You know, uh, I've seen a lot of kits uh, the past couple of weeks here, and I love them. They are great. Um, if you have a chance to go see them, go check them out. They are unique. They are nice. And um, I can't wait to go see another one. So thank you, everyone, for joining me on this home tour. Stay tuned for the next one. This one was a small one. The next one's going to be a huge one. But again, thanks for joining me. Remember to live smarter, choose manufactured, have a wonderful day, and travel easy.